Hey folks, Sheila here from Design Files. If you're dealing with large scale projects and you have dozens and dozens of design boards within the project and you're just looking for an easier and faster way to be able to just reorganize uh, the individual design boards or move them into folders, this new update is for you. Now the team has made some great improvements here um, because we wanted to make that whole process of reordering your design boards or grouping them into folders a lot easier for you so that your projects are more manageable. And as I was just showing you, you now have the ability to just drag and drop the individual design boards from this view to reorder them. But we didn't want to stop at just individual, uh, like allowing you to move individual design boards. So what we've also done is we've included a multi-select. If I hold the left button down on my mouse and drag over top of individual design boards like this, you can see that I can select multiple at once. And once I've selected them at once, I can actually go ahead and I can just click and drag them to reorder them within this view and they'll show up in the new order. So it makes organizing your individual design boards within this view a lot faster and a lot easier. But the other thing that you can do with this is that you can actually move your individual design boards or groupings of design boards into organized folders within your project. So you can see here, I've created individual folders for uh, the office designs, the hallway designs, the bedroom designs. You might even wanna have folders for archive designs or even your client presentation deck. You can create as many folders as you like, and then you'll be able to just drag and drop individual design boards directly into those folders. Now, in this case, you can see here that this is for my upstairs hallway. So I'm gonna go ahead and drag that into the hallway folder. All of these are for the office. So I'm just gonna click and multi-select all of these individual designs and drag them into the office folder. Now, the other thing that I can do here is, let's go ahead, we're gonna multi-select these ones as well. But when I multi-select a bunch of design boards, you will see that this panel still shows up. So you can absolutely still use this bottom panel where it's saying five are selected, and I can click this icon to add these selected designs to a specific folder. It's gonna open up this panel and I'll see the drop down where it's listing all the folders that I've already created. And I could just dump those individual designs specifically into that uh, particular folder and then move them over. So you still have access to that, but you also have that easy drag and drop option as well. Now, the cool thing about this is that you can also click directly into the folders and then you can start shifting the designs around within the folder as well. So you could bring your mood boards up to the top if you wanted to, you can reorganize so that you have your floor plans following that. Um, and again, you can either move individual ones or you can select a variety of the individual design boards and shift them around within your project. Now, the other thing that you can do here is, let's say that I accidentally added a specific design to this folder that I didn't want included. So we'll just say that I'm going to click this one, this one, this one, whatever. These are some design boards that I wanna move out of this folder. When I select the individual designs, again, this panel will pop up and I can go ahead and I can click on this icon and it'll show me the drop down list where I could move them to individual folders or I could move them back to the project level. So I always have this available to me, but again, I could just, just to speed up the overall process, just click and drag those directly over here to move them back to the project. And when I'm ready to go back to the project level myself, I would click here again, and then that's gonna bring me back into this view and we'll see those individual designs that I just shifted out of that office um, folder. So definitely log into your Design Files account and give this new update a try. If you are dealing with dozens and dozens of design boards because you're designing for a full house or you've got loads of archive designs that you just wanna organize into specific folders or shift around, this new update is gonna make the process of reorganizing designs within your project a lot easier for you. And of course, if you do have any questions whatsoever, feel free to reach out to us on the live chat. We're always happy to help. Thanks for watching.